guys welcome back to another video if you guys are stopping by for the first time my name is Ron and this is MotorTube I bring you guys the coolest car videos on YouTube so make sure you go ahead and hit the subscribe button and let's get going so this is what's gonna happen today today is kind of a very serious video no I'm just kidding it's not serious but it is kind of serious so we are headed to my friend my friend has a sick gold M4 and terrible news something bad happened to the car if you guys have aren't haven't already read the uh the title of the video yes that happened so somebody did something very bad to the car and we're about to go check it out and uh it didn't look it looked pretty bad actually in the video he sent me but we're gonna go and actually check it out and see how bad it is and the cost of it i know but i'm gonna confirm it with him once i go there and it's it's ridiculously high so anyways let's start the hellcat right now because that's exactly where we're going to be taking let me find my keys real quick all right got the red keys and yeah, let's get down here and turn it on all right guys we are here um, it is such a nice neighborhood here. As, as, as you guys can see, look at all these houses. Man, these houses are huge. Look at this. Oh, man. Look at all these houses are huge. Bro. Oh, man, bro. Your view is so nice. Thank you. Before we get to the cars, I want to look at this. I don't think I've ever came all the way here. Dance side. Dude, I thought your house was over there. No. Is that a kitchen outside? Uh -huh. Boy, you could... <laughs> Dude, me, I swear, like, you know, like, you know how Dan has, like, this whole thing, like, a big door? Where you could literally pull a car in? What? He has that down there? Yeah, where is his house? So, well, anyways, it's like a big, like, it's a huge door. So what I would do if this was my house... <laughs> I'd literally have a driveway coming down from there. Those wouldn't be garages. Those would just be a house. So I'd have a driveway coming down from there all the way here and I'll put like literally my, 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 my floor would be marble and look like a showroom and I'll just put all my cars in there. <laughs> I swear bro, that's like my dream. Like I thought of that when I seen so that. So you're not gonna like do anything to the basement? No, man, bro, my basement will be literally like cars, like just nice cars, showroom. not like, yeah. you know, I'm talking about like the nice cars will just be like, you know, and then there'll be like games and TVs I around there. Never thought about like doing like because I think of cars as like 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 they're like you know like decoration. You know, you have nice cars there while you. You need a lot, of, a lot of work. Yeah, it'd be a lot. Of, I mean, it wouldn't be that much. Think about it. It's, the, the biggest thing is making this a driveway. Yeah. yeah. And you need to like, dude, level it up, make, you know, because you're gonna be scraping so much. Oh yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. So, right when you get down. Yeah, but you don't have to. You could extend the driveway to like here. So the, ugly, the longer though. no, like the whole backyard in general, it would look ugly. ugly. I mean the inside, yeah. Well, no, I mean, you, you could any of this. listen. All you gotta do is put the same thing, stretch it all the way out here, and stretch this all the way out there. You could still, you know, put the little things on the side. It doesn't have to be this wide, but you just need to make a wide driveway, and you'd come all the way here. And 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 and, and your your dailies or whatever, you could just park them out here, bro. That'd be so <laughs> sick. That'd be so sick. This is a nice view though, Loki. It's so cold, bro. I know, cause you're you're by water. All right, guys, we are gonna go up there now. That's enough of the view and talking. We're gonna go up there to look at what happened in this car. Man, look how nice she sits. <laughs> there was, bro. Literally, there's this black Hellcat that pulled up next to me, and this guy was literally like drooling over the the wheels. He was like looking. You no, it was the most stock black, manual, dirty, never cleaned it in his life, uh, no tints, no, I'm like, what? Anyways, is it here? Yeah. Alright guys, I don't know if you guys can see this, because this color is so bright, so this is where the king starts, here, 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 it was worse, but he, he tried to buff some of it up, some of it up, here, here, so, the guy got tired here. So then he restarted from down here and then he kept going kept going. This is all here all here more 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 
more. He got here. He's like, yeah, I can still squeeze some more. He here. He's like, okay, let me get here. It started getting a little harder, so he started getting a little deeper. Then it goes all the way here. Then he, then after all of this, he took the bus home. Because, of course, he was broke and he didn't know how to appreciate cars. So, if you're watching, I'm glad you can even afford internet to watch this video. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But that is such a hateful, like, thing to do. Like, to scratch this nice car. And, and the kid is nice. I mean... He, He's never had problems with anybody. I don't understand why people would do this. Like, look how beautiful this car is. And, and, and that's exactly why I don't take my car anywhere and leave it un unattended. So if I go to, like, shopping, I don't take this car. If I go anywhere where I know I'm not going to be right next to the car, I will not take it. Because, believe it or not, a lot of people hate me. So imagine somebody that people don't even, they don't even know the guy that much. They don't, they don't, he doesn't even do anything. He doesn't, he's not even on social media like that. And they did that to his car. Imagine what they do to my car. Some guy even threatened me on YouTube because I was speeding. He said he sees me, he's going to throw a brick in my car. And I take those threats very serious. So whenever you guys actually have some sort of hate towards me, make sure you keep the same energy when you see me. I promise it won't go the way you think it will. Trust me. So don't ever threaten me thinking I won't take it serious when I see you in person. So anyways, done with the negative stuff. Um, so I'm about to take him for a ride. This time I actually got a suction cup. Look at these. The brightest two colors you could possibly get. We're gonna leave the Hellcat here. We're gonna jump in the M4 and go for a drive right now. I actually have a suction cup this time. So we'll be able to get better videos. Man, this Austin Yellow is so sick. Just, oh man. I don't even like foreign cars like this, but this car is so sick. see the new m5 look where we parked oh man it looks so good right it looks so good next to the jeep wow this thing is sick it has the blue brakes me for what this is nice oh my god how much how much Bro, this this color is sick in the X5. How much is this car? 150. That's not that bad. It's really bad. That's so cheap. Wow. This is nice. Watch out. This is beautiful. We got we got the gold and he found his BMW. See, this is what cars do. Just random people come up to you. We are arguing about the Trackhawk. So one thing I'm going to tell you about is the Trackhawk and just the Jeep SRT in general. Jeep SRT your M sure. will lose more value than the Jeep SRT. Look it up. No. Look it up. You won't find a Jeep SRT that's the 14 body for under 40 grand. Stop. With, with 5,000, okay, 10,000 miles. A new, find a new X6 or X5M for after 2015 for under 70 grand. Fine. How much are they? How much are they buying new though? Okay, exactly. You just lost like 50 grand. The Jeep SRT is like 60, 65. It didn't lose that much. It's not about well, how much. They're so cheap to begin with. No, they're not. They're 65, 70. Trackhawks are overpriced though. They're 100 grand. Track should be okay, they're 100 grand, but they're not going to lose value. I promise you that. They're not going to lose value. And it's an SUV, bro. It's an American car. It's an SUV with 700 horsepower. How bro, could you go wrong like, with How do you spend that much money for a car that literally does the interior is not trash, bro. You, cause you've never experienced like actually like owning a foreign car and like. Cause I don't the need to. Difference. I don't need to pay 150 grand for an XL. What is this guy doing? I don't need to pay 150 grand for an XL, right? Huh? I rather, I'd rather get the Trackhawk over the XL any day. Well, no. Because a Trackhawk is more of a, full, it's a full car, but the suspension you could put in rear wheel drive, 80, 20. You, there's so much option you could do in that car, bro. It can actually tow. It can. It can, it can actually tow. And the XF can't tow a freaking brick. Yeah, it could. First off, how much you want to bet? What are you gonna tow? You're gonna. Look. You know what you're gonna tow? I'll tell you what you. Good. Here's why I hate scat bags. 
You're gonna tow your thousand horsepower Hellcat that's in a trailer. With XL, what are you gonna tow? M4? Where yeah. are you gonna be going? To, to M1? And then stow car over a track. Oh hell no, yo. I'm, I'm done. I guys. All right. My argument is a Hellcat will make you smile more than this. So we're gonna test that. I'm gonna let him drive it, and we're gonna see how happy he gets. So what? I just put it in second. I just put it in second. Let me pass this bottle. Power shift. Is it in second? Right now. Feels way faster when I'm in the passenger seat, but I mean it's still fast. Well, I don't know why I didn't. It didn't pull me back like I thought it would. But I mean I'm. Like ready for the pull. First, you're ready for it. Second, you got both. You're in control, so you're not scared when you're in control that much. Yeah, they still spun though. Oh, and it spun when it's cold that time. It has traction on. It had traction on. It's just what's it called? It's spun. It's spun because it's really cold that time. All right, guys. So I'm about to end the video here. Uh, we finally let a uh, BMW owner drive the Hellcat. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you're new to this channel, make sure you go ahead and subscribe, browse through the channel, turn the notification bell, do all that good stuff. And I will see you guys next time. Love you guys. Peace.